4-1 weather with Damian Lotus. Well, if you've been waiting for the perfect weather to get outside to do something, especially on a Sunday afternoon, you could not have asked for any better conditions here for this afternoon because at that cold front that swept its way through the state early this morning. Instead of seeing that record breaking heat in the triple digits, today I'm tracking temperatures only in the 80s and 90s. Let's get ready for the latest here. I'll start you off with a time lapse. This is of downtown Oklahoma City and you can see a little bit of cloud coverage passing from time to time, but overall we are going to see nice blue skies here for the rest of the day. It's going to be a spectacular afternoon here for us. Here's a look at our storm scanner. In addition to the cooler weather, I was also tracking some early morning showers. These showers moved through the metro around 430 this morning and it's continuing to work its way across eastern Oklahoma. These showers are slowly losing intensity as they continue to drift their way off to the east, so we will see them come to an end in the next about hour or so. But for northern and for western Oklahoma, nice blue skies, lots of sunshine. Winds will be northerly, a little bit breezy here for your early Sunday morning. Temperature wise, take a look at this. We have a mix of 60s and 70s here for the Oklahoma City Metro. More 60s across western and northwestern Oklahoma, and we still have some 80s across eastern and southeastern parts of the state. The cold front is going to continue to sweep its way through the state as we head throughout this afternoon. And compared to right now, to this time yesterday morning, we are already 5 to 10 degrees cooler than what I was tracking yesterday. And this map is only going to look better as we head into this afternoon. In addition to all this good news, the best thing I'm going to share with you this morning is Rufus here. And Rufus is available for adoption right now from Country Roads Animal Rescue. We need to get this sweet pup right here at Forever Home. For the forecast today, if you're taking the pets outside, Beautiful weather. Highs will be in the upper 80s to low 90s. Lots of sunshine. Winds will be a little bit breezy, so keep that in mind. But here it is right there. I mean, you can't beat this, right, Caitlin? After the triple digits we've been seeing. I mean, look at this. 80s and 90s across central and northern Oklahoma. We will see some mid to upper 90s across the Red River Valley for this afternoon. It's still going to be hot for some parts of the state. For Oklahoma City, getting up to 90 degrees. Still warm, still hot this afternoon, but compared to the record-breaking triple digits these past couple of days, I think we've earned this nice little break. Now, yesterday, this map right here was lighting up like a Christmas tree. Today, we only have one county, McCurtain County in far southeastern Oklahoma, under a heat advisory. That's great compared to what we have been seeing. This is what it's going to feel like this afternoon. We will still see some triple-digit heat index values across far southeastern Oklahoma. And then as we head into this evening and tonight, I will be tracking a low chance of rain across the Oklahoma Panhandle, another low chance of rain across the Red River Valley as we head into the overnight hours. But the best news of all, the way we're really going to feel the effects of this cold front will be tonight. Look at these lows. We'll be in the 50s, the 50s across eastern or western and northwestern parts of the state. 60s here for tonight across the majority of Oklahoma. That is going to feel very refreshing here as we head into the overnight hours. For today, I'll be tracking partly cloudy skies. Highs will be a mix of upper 80s to low 90s. Beautiful weather here for today. Overnight lows will be in the 60s for the next couple of mornings. That's going to feel a little fall like Weird. next chance of rain. Yes, next chance of rain will be in the forecast on Tuesday. And then after that, enjoy the cooler weather because I am tracking. It looks like one more ramp up of heat as we head into next weekend. And you know what I just realized? What? The pumpkin spice, all that stuff is just now starting to come back. And with temperatures in the 60s during the mornings, it's going to feel like it. It's going to feel like it. It's almost, uh, what is it, sweater? Sw sweater weather. Sweater weather. Sweater weather. Sweater weather. There you go. That's what it's going to feel like. <laughs> Yay. Thank you, Dave.